Thank you. May your perfect will manifest in his life, wherever he goes. In the name of Jesus, lead him on the path of righteousness. Every day, deliver him from the evil by the power of the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit, come and have your way with all of us. Start, Father, start with me. Touch my heart, my mind, my soul, my heart, everything, my whole body. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Father God, I anoint this man. Pastors, lay hands on him. Pray. The Bible says, is there, is there anyone sick? Call out the elders, anoint them with oil and pray. We're doing that. We're laying hands and we're praying. And we say, Father, whatever needs to be healed, let it be healed by the power of, Father, of your blood. In the name that is above every other name, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We bless this woman. In the name of Jesus. Come, I promised you, I will bring the oil and I will anoint you. You know, here is the word from God to you. Because you have been asking, you will receive. Because you were pursuing, He will deliver. Because you have a zeal to receive, He says He will give you a double portion. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I bless this young woman with your perfect will, Father. I bless her today. I pray that no evil will touch her. I pray that no weapon forged against her will prosper against her, will not prevail. And I pray that no lying time will succeed in her life. I say blessing, prosperity, freedom, and the will of our Father which is in heaven over her life in the name of Jesus. Stretch your hands. Stretch your hands like you are about to receive a gift. In the name of Jesus, I anoint your hands. And I pray, let her receive what you have for her in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, come. Come, Father, with your fire. The fire of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Bless her. Bless her with your will. Bless her with you. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You are blessed and loved. Would you like a prayer? Like Take off your heart. You know, guys, I, I just like to say, you got such an amazing hair. The more I lose, the more I envy. It's just, you know, the beauty of our Father, the colors that He created, you know, the differences that we have. Amazing. Father God, if it's possible, give me His hair. <laughs> If not, it's okay with my soul. Whatever your will is, in the name of Jesus, I bless this young man. I bless you, Father, with your will in his life. Protect him, keep him, bless him. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I bless his soul, his spirit, his mind, his heart, and his body. Watch over these young people. Father, they are the future of this country. Raise your children. Raise the young people up so they can lead us into victory, so they can lead the people out of Egypt. Their own people, the young, let them be a voice crying out in the wilderness. Let them raise their voices and say, Thus says the Lord. God is saying to you, Who will go for us against the evildoers? I pray that those two will say, here we are, Lord, use us. In the name of Jesus, I bless them. I bless this man. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for this woman. Bless her, keep her, and protect her. May your perfect will always manifest in her life. Thank you for her heart. You know, you have a gentle smile, but God says, I am going to use you as a mighty lioness you're going to be his lioness you're going to roar you're going to stand up he has given you eyes to see you see things 
you get the wisdom you get the understanding in the name of Jesus I pray that you would raise her up to be a voice I see you walking Savannah and roaring all those lionesses are so powerful the guys the lions are lazy and the lions in this land have become lazy they are under a tree napping and the Bible says that my shepherds my leaders are dumb dogs they don't even know how to bark anymore so God is going to raise up Esther's and Deborah's you are going to be his Deborah you will lead people into something in the name of Jesus I pray you're going to open the doors that no man can shut you're going to lead her father in the name of Jesus let her be the Deborah of today if the men don't want to fight let the women rise up in the name Amen. of Jesus if the pastors don't want to roar let the women start roaring in the land in the name of Jesus I bless you I pray that God would protect you in this in this journey and I see you walking proudly with your head high roaming the savannah you understand who your father is you know who your God is and the enemy fears you in the name of Jesus go go and do what he wants you to do and you will succeed amen amen, amen. father God